steam to ice. Woohoo! And the cheese and the bacon. Burger rolls, hamburgers. And that's the rice cooking. These are the burgers I'll be using. Philly Gourmet 1% pure beef. I'm start patties. And quarter pound patties. Those are the hamburger rolls that I got from Publix about a week ago. They've been sitting in the refrigerator. Here's a pair of the grill. I get the charcoal the way I always cook it is by using charcoal lighter on the paper, the paper under it. Like a truck, I start to get ready to put it in the grill. Since this, bur this is only for burgers, I don't really need, need to use that much charcoal. So that's the truck I use for that. So I'll spray the truck, lay the fluid on it, get it nice and soaked, saturated, so it'll light easier, and stay lit. And the paper will also be an igniter too. It'll keep it from draining off. It's a good thing. You get each one of the brickets saturated. That should be good enough. Now that the brickets have been hot and lit up, I can now close the hood. And then I'll get it heat up. Now it is time to put the burgers on the grill. And I used too much charcoal because I only put in two hamburgers. But, oh well, too late. So I'll be ready in a few minutes. About three. 10 minutes, and I'll flip them, and they will be cooking. I'm going to put the bacon in the grill. It's in aluminum, so as to not flame, because bacon makes a lot of grease. Now it's time to flip the burgers. It's smoking now. Burger's almost done. I'm gonna put the bacon over a little bit. Be done in a few minutes. Bacon cheeseburger is almost done. And there it is, bacon cheeseburger, ready to bite. <laughs>